Okay. Suppose you are given that you have to factorize 25 a square minus 16 b square. Now, can you write this in the form of the equation a square plus b square plus minus 2ab? Well, it seems I can't do that because there are only two variables out here, right? And the third variable, if it is not there, means, I mean, I can write zero here, but then that doesn't solve the problem because if either of these a or b is zero, then these has to be zero, which is not the case here. So accordingly, if I look at these two numbers, let me try to put them in a form a square minus b square. So this is the only identity where I think this can fit in. So 25a square, 25a square can be written as 5 into 5, which is 25 into a into a. So 5 is coming two times, I can write this as 5 square into a square or I can write this as 5a whole square. So this becomes 5a whole square minus. Similarly, if you do it for 16b square, let's say 16b square, it can be written as 4 into 4 into b into b. So these two numbers are appearing twice. So 4 square into b square or 4b whole square. Now, if I compare this, this can be written as a square minus b square. a is equal to what? 5a. So 5a is equal to a and b is equal to 4b. Incidentally, both them of them are a into b. Now, a square minus b square, we could have written as what? a plus b into a minus b. Or I can write this as 5a plus 4b into 5a minus 4b. So these become the factor of equation.